अंडे अब कभी नहीं आएंगे अंडे टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अ न्यू टॉपिक दैट इज हीटिंग जोन्स लैटिट्यूड्स एज वी डिस्कस इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो हेल्पिंग अस इन डिवाइडिंग द अर्थ इन टू डिफरेंट हीटिंग जोन्स फर्स्ट इज टॉयलेट जोन टेम्परेट जोन और मॉडरेट जोन एंड थर्ड इज फ्रिजेड जोन नो वी आर गोइंग टू ड्रॉ दीज जोन्स ऑन द अर्थ दिस इज योर जीरो डिग्री इक्वेटर In the northern hemisphere, there is another latitude called twenty-three degree and a half north. It is also known as Tropic of Cancer. Tropic of Cancer. in the southern hemisphere another latitude named 23 degree and a half south or tropic of capricorn tropic of from tropic of cancer to tropic of capricorn this region is called torrid zone because here temperature is very high throughout the year this is your torrid zone 23 degree and half north to 23 degree and half south latitudes because here the sun rays fall vertically through the second suppose this is the sun the rays of the sun fall vertically first thing distance between sun and this region is less and third these rays occupy less area so they give more heat second is this is your 66 degree and a half north latitude or arctic circle arctic circle from 66 degree and a half north to 23 degree and a half north or from arctic circle to tropic of cancer this region is called temperate zone or moderate zone in the northern hemisphere same in the southern hemisphere this is 66 degree and a half south latitude or antarctic circle means there is one torrid zone and two temperate zones from 23 degree and a half south to 66 degree and a half south latitude there is a another temperate zone here we find summers as well as winters areas 
near to torrid zone having more months of summers areas near to poles they having more winter months in, in this region we have summers as well as winters but in torrid zone there is only one season that is summers and the last is frigid zone in the northern hemisphere from 66 degree and half north to north pole in the southern hemisphere from antarctic circle or 66 degree and half south latitude to south pole these regions are frigid regions because here the rays of the sun fall slanted they occupy suppose is there the rays of the sun these this ray occupy bigger area than the, this ray slanted rays difference is more that is why these regions are very cold throughout the year in the end i am going to ask two questions my first question is what is the region of torrid zone or in between in which latitudes we find torrent region second question is where we find winters as well as summers thank you